Lisa here and in today's video I thought I'd show you our living area all decorated for Christmas and also I'll go through our office area as well. So actually we'll start on our office area. So we have like a little office nook here. Most of you have already seen the setup of my house so you'll know. So all I've done for my office nook I've just switched out the prints in those frames and those I've just found some nice pictures that I liked on the internet and printed them out and put them in the frame. So my Halloween ones are behind those and my regular farmhouse ones are behind those. And this uh, next year I'll print off some Easter ones and they'll go in there as well. So that's how I like to just sort of easily and cheaply swap out my decor. Next to that, I have my little Santa Claus that I inherited off my mum and he's just sitting there with a little pine cone. Then next to that, I have my Ikea lantern with a red candle in it. And then moving down to the next shelf, that's the other matching Santa to the other one. Again, a couple more pine cones. These I've just gathered from around our property. We have a lot of pine trees in our area. I have a Kmart candle burning behind that, which smells absolutely beautiful. It's part of the, it's the berry and silver. There's a three pack of them. And I think they're the berry and silver pack. And I think the fragrance is patchouli or something like that. And again, I've just printed off some images off the internet and put them in the frames there to make it more Christmassy. And then next to that, that was also inherited off my mum, the big Santa Claus and the reindeer. And behind that, I just have a tin bucket, which I got from Kmart. And the plant in it is an Ikea one. And I've just put in a few berry sprigs in amongst it and they were from Kmart as well. So that's my little shelf above our office nook. And then I haven't done anything too major on our desk area on either side, but in the middle here, I just have my Noel letters. Now I'm not sure where I got those from. Were they Kmart? I can't remember now. I think I'm pretty sure they might have been Kmart. And then next to that is just a little holly sprig. And then this big box here is actually my body shop advent calendar. I treated myself to an advent calendar this year. I've loved them forever. And yeah, I think, how stunning does that look? So you have one little box. I won't open it yet, but that's number one. So one little box that you get to open each day and it has a body shop product in it. And I'm hoping to do Vlogmas this year. Uh, <laughs> I've never done uh, everyday vlogging before, so um, I'll see how I go. I may film every day, but maybe just upload once a week. I'll see like how it actually works out but yeah i'll probably be opening one of those each day of um december as well so you can see what's actually in it so that's my little advent calendar for this year and that again like i said was from the body shop so i'm looking forward to that and then moving into the living area i'll give you like a long shot of our living area I've gone with the traditional reds and whites and greens because I just absolutely love the way it looks. So on this table here, I have more pine cones and it's like a little candy cane candle. And this is my antique bird cage, which I picked up from a thrift store. Was it not really a thrift store, more like an antique type store i think it was this year i'm pretty no it must have been last year because i had it last year as well and i've just filled it up with some christmas balls and some pine cones it's a bit hard to see and i've put some fairy lights in there and then topped it off with a sprig at the top there and then those are just some christmas ornaments 
So that's our side table. And then on the lounge here, oh, the kids upside down pillow, seriously. <laughs> so I just have this pillow case was from eBay. It was only about $3 and I've just covered one of my regular pillows with that. The big fluffy white one was Kmart and this throw blanket it's actually just a piece of material from a spotlight it's like that felt not is it felt yeah like a felt sort of material because i couldn't find a throw in those sort of colors what i was after and i just was at spotlight the other day and saw this material there so i thought oh, i'll just grab about a meter of it so that's like half a meter there and i've got another half a meter tucked in a basket so that just sort of brings in a pop of tartan color to the to the space and then this is our christmas tree i've already done a video on decorating that christmas tree and that will be linked in my description box below and then on our three-seater couch here this big striped pillow that was from big w um, i don't think it's actually part of their christmas range i think it was just one of their regular pillows but I just grabbed it because it looked very Christmassy to me. I just have a throw rug on the lounge here that I picked up from eBay for about $10 and another one of those furry cushions from Kmart. Then on the coffee table here, I'll bring you around this way. So I just have a reindeer antler on the table there, which I picked up from Spotlight last year. And I've just decorated that with some Christmas balls, more pine cones, and a wicker love heart. The love heart was from the reject shop. And then in this tray here, I have my sexy man candle burning. And I can definitely tell you, yes, it smells just as nice burning as it does in the pot. So definitely pick those up. Uh, I've already got one more, so I think I'm going to pick up a few more before they don't stock them anymore because it smells really nice and it goes all throughout the whole house. Then on this tray, I've just decorated with a reindeer uh, Christmas tree ornament. That was just from Kmart. This little sleigh was a DIY makeover I did last year. And again, that will be in my Christmas playlist if you want to see how I've done that. And that's just fi um, finished off with a couple of reindeer ornaments. Um, more pine cones and that pot puree fill I just like to decorate with as well. And then this little sparkly lantern was from Kmart last year. I haven't seen them this year, so yeah, I'm not sure if they still have them. So that's our coffee table. And then moving on to this corner, I have this Christmas tree, I'm pretty sure was Target last year. And I've just finished it off with a couple of berry sprigs and these Christmas lights in the little, what do you call them, cork bottles. They are from Kmart and I think they're just really cute. They've got little Christmas tree and snowflakes in them. So topped it off with those. And there's just a couple of tiny glass ornaments. I'm not sure where I got those tiny ones from, maybe the reject shop a few years ago. And I just have a couple of Christmas balls sitting at the bottom of that tree. And then moving down to the next shelf, just got a few more Christmas balls. And then that it's the season to be jolly sign was from the reject shop. And then on this level, I have a sprig of holly there. That was from, I think that was from Bed, Bath and Table in their last year Christmas sale. And then the reindeer candle that was from Kmart last year and the let it snow sign was from the reject shop. And then in the bottom one there is a basket with just some leftover pine cones. Then I've put all my trunks and suitcases stacked up in this corner for now. And on top of that, I have my two reindeers from Kmart. I really like those, they're super cute. This box or container basket thing here was a DIY makeover I did last year as well. So that will be in my Christmas playlist. And I've just filled that with some more pine cones, 
some pot puree and some pine and berry sprigs as well. And the bead chain, that was from Kmart as well. So that's that corner. Then on this chair, I just have another one of those eBay pillowcases that I picked up for a couple of dollars. And then the white one in front is the Kmart fringe cushion, which I finally managed to get my hands on. I think I ended up buying about four of them. Uh, <laughs> Kmart finally stocked them, but I think I bought pretty much the last four and I haven't seen them since. So sorry if I hoarded all of them. <laughs> and then underneath here, I have my wicker hamper basket which is also from kmart and another piece of that material from spotlight i've just put in there for a pop of color and on top of this side table i just have a vase with some pine cone sprigs and berry sprigs all from kmart uh, that's just a lamp that's actually from kmart as well and then I've got a poinsettia plant in a tin bucket, which was from Kmart. The poinsettia plant though, I'm pretty sure was from the reject shop. And then two little Christmas trees here. They were, I'm pretty sure the reject shop as well. I think they used to be gold and I gave them a bit of a paint makeover last year. So yeah, that's our living area all decked out for Christmas. I did want to pick up a Christmas, Christmassy looking rug for the area, but I haven't been able to find one as yet. I just wanted something with a bit of red in it, but the one that we've got there will do for now. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video guys. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. I've got heaps more Christmas videos coming up for you guys. And I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.